Welcome back to you at 933 your time. Let's talk about your health on this okay. Friday. More than one in five Americans are living with a mental health disorder. Wow. And now researchers are looking at how exposure to light could impact that. Could it affect like a person's uh, chances of developing a psychiatric condition? And what can you do about it? You use it to see the world around you. But now researchers are finding light can affect your mental health in more ways than one. In the world's largest study on light exposure and mental health, researchers found people exposed to high amounts of light at night had a 30% increased risk of developing depression and a greater chance of psychosis, bipolar disorder, anxiety, PTSD, and self-harm. On the other hand, those who were exposed to higher amounts of light during the day had a 20% lower risk of depression and were less likely to develop those other conditions. One possible reason for the link is exposure to light at night. Well, that can misalign your circadian rhythms. Of course, that's your body's internal clock. Most people end up getting misaligned by, say, staying up to 11 o'clock in front of a bright screen, watching TV. To get the right amount of light exposure, try taking a short walk outside in the morning or around lunchtime. Maybe set up your workspace, if this is possible, near a window to attract more natural light. Put down your devices at night. Maybe read a book instead. If you do use your phone, adjust the settings. Decrease that blue light exposure as much as you can. And if you can't get enough sunlight during the fall and winter, maybe consider using a, a bright light box at home. Bright light is supposed to um, help people uh, realign circadian misalignment. Just trying to help you get that right amount of light to improve your mental health. Okay, in 2022, uh, analysis from that year, researchers found that in 33% of the studies they looked at, people slept less after being exposed to that blue light. So you're